figure TV. Long little pimp, man. Long little pimp. You know, uh, I played the, I did a live last night. Hey, man, say, man, what happened to Screw? What happened to Pimp C? Bringing that back to the surface. A lot of people been asking me to review the new information that came out about Pimp C. I thought they was talking about the sex tape. A lot of y'all know y'all asked me about that on my Instagram. I thought y'all was talking about that sex tape. And I was like, man, I'm not finna get into the... Because it ain't nothing we can do about that sex tape. I had no idea y'all was talking about Buddy. Kill Pimp C. I had no freaking idea y'all was talking about new information that Pimp C, cousin, Edgar, and partner both bro brought to the table saying, buddy, this nigga, Spike Pimp C punch. And people know this, and he bragged about it, Jackson, Mississippi, y'all get that cuff figure, I know Jack fuck with me. I telling y'all, remember I just did a story on Jack Mississippi how we gotta stand up against that racism down there, and how they mistreating our brothers and sisters. But we also gotta stand up against the blackface Ku Klux Klan. I know they say Buddy died the same way Pimp died, and his brother was ground up like some hit shit. But where smoke is fire, who told Buddy to get on Pimp Trail? Let's rewind this story. Salute, first of all, to this super tight. I'm going to use some of y'all content. Salute to Bobo, Edgar, uh, 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 Bobo, your you old lady. This was some legendary stuff y'all did. And this it video gave me goosebumps, man. Like, what the fuck? I feel so bad for Pimp C. When I heard this story, man. Salute to Young Pimp. Salute to he's Leo C. Ripper, the whole... Uh, Everybody that's holding Pimp name down. I seen he's a Leo on the interview. I didn't even see that new salute to you. He's, I didn't see when you said on that inter the interview, yeah, now you you feel like somebody put your partner in a trick bag and, and spiked his punch. You standing on it, bro. That's all you, you standing on it, Heezy. That's good, bro. That's serious business. The ones that are fans of Pimp C, we got to come out and let our voice be heard. Justice for Pimp C, man. And then, and then, then that old, he did, nah, 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 my nigga. We need to, it, because they, they put Pimp C name out there in the media and everything, talking about he died of overdoses and shit, drug related, like they said about DJ Screw. And and how, and we know Screw Cousin said that the coroner told him DJ Screw was poisoned, and Screw Cousin say, man, said Screw had that, what, had, what in his system, something like Pimp C. We be, I believe both of them got their spirit. Punch spike, but we just gonna deal with pimp on this one. I felt so bad for Pimp C that this nigga buddy baited him in by giving him a million dollars. And wow, buddy told Mama West after Pimp was dead he owned UGK. And I just can't believe that everybody that ain't came out the rap industry to I, I they ain't came out and made a statement on we got the eat. Make sure the media take that back saying Pimp C overdosed on drugs. That's a damn lie. Pimp C was murdered. The nigga buddy was bragging in Jackson, Mississippi that he killed Pimp. This is crazy, man. I, I, it, it, it hurt me so bad that Pimp C went in the bathroom to use the bathroom real quick. And a nigga spiked his punch. He came back, y'all. So in your mind, you can go to the last. Just imagine. Nigga that kicking it. Niggas, man, let me use the bathroom real quick. Y'all go to the bathroom, and a nigga spike his punch. He come back, hit. Uh, they say he immediately start throwing. Uh, 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 uh. I'm going to post this picture because this is a good picture. We're going to put this picture inside the interview. Okay. Okay. I'm going to show it to my wife. I want y'all to take a look at this nigga in the back. That's Buddy. That's Buddy. This nigga in the back, Buddy, killed Pimp C. Spiked his punch, man. This might open up some details in the DJ screw now, but I'm going to separate this. 
This is about pimp. Justin for pimp C. This is wrong. And we need to stop talking about the conspiracies behind that goddamn sex tape because they didn't make people mind. Oh, man, I'm not. We forget all that. We know that the point is right here. This man spiked Pimp C punch, then called his mom and say, I own UGK now. Then he got whacked. Then his, his brother get whacked. But who do, who whacked them? If it, I, I, Listen. If it wasn't Pimp people, was they somebody shutting them? If it wasn't Pimp people, was somebody shutting them up? This real talk. You know what I'm saying? This is vicious. Bundy was supposed to be here. Mm, okay. You know what I'm saying? But he had to go take her family emergency. Yeah. This was Bundy's uh, rap partner, uh, X Mile. You know what I'm talking about? Mm hmm. And that's Buddy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, who's Buddy? Okay. When y'all when, when y'all ask me who is Buddy, so tell me about Buddy. Can you? Buddy, the nigga who killed my cousin. Oh, Pimp C cousin right here, Edgar. Edgar saying, Buddy, the nigga who killed my cousin. So we standing on that now. Buddy killed Pimp C? Justin for Pimp. Jack's Mississippi. Y'all who was Jack that fuck with me, get my uh, DMs, man. Is the nigga Buddy was walking around there bragging about killing Pimp? And this is another thing that I don't like. I do not like this. I don't like that Mama West was trying to exhume pimp body to see if he had some, some some poisons in him and she was wanting to get the money together. Now, I know nobody, oh, nobody, nothing in this goddamn world. I want to start with that because I know a lot of niggas feel, man, you can't count nigga pockets. You can't be pocket watching niggas. But I'll be damned. If all the niggas who say they love pimp in the industry, nigga couldn't get pimp body exhumed and see if he was bought, murdered? What Pac said? Nigga feel stronger than love, nigga. Remember when Pac said that? Pac said, shit, bigger than mine had love for me, nigga, but they feared them other niggas. You understand? Was niggas scared to death that they didn't want to help pimp because they didn't want to get hit? Because it makes no sense why Pimp Mama had to try to raise the money. Raise the money? Niggas ain't throwing money at Mama West to get Pimp. I'm talking about the niggas who had it. And we know niggas. They're like, man, you really don't know. Niggas be fake. You really don't. Oh, man. That's, a, that's disgusting, man. That's disgusting. That's a scandal within itself, fam. That was, it hit me like, what? Nigga been calling people and say, man, I got that. DJ Paul, you think, I'm talking about you big wig pimps, uh, 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 too short. Pimpy King, you too pimp? Because you niggas say you love pimp, man. Why y'all didn't get that money? Because you niggas like, man, I'm going to stay out of that. That's heavy. Hmm? Is it heavy? I told y'all, man. It's a dangerous life, y'all. Stay away from the streets. They don't love you. They never will. That's for real. The streets will never love you, man. They could say, buddy killed my cousin. I want to go back to buddy. That's what I want to do. I want to that picture. Buddy. This cat right here, this clown right here, killed Pimp C. And I know they were saying in an interview, he a very, he was hanging with some dangerous people. Look, man. You can... Die slipping out the shower. You might get in your car of a car wreck. You might go outside and a stray bullet hit you from some blackface Ku Klux Klan members who's shooting up the community. Anything can happen to you. Stop being so fearful. So many people scared of your damn shadow, man. Be dangerous your goddamn self. Let people see, and this is the problem. Don't be letting people, this is what they probably don't do. Don't let people just be around you to see how you move, when you move, what's your weaknesses. No. They don't need to see none. They don't need to get a, a, a free glance at nothing. Nathaniel. That's why I'm very just cheesy on how I do what. And then I, it's just 24-7 activated. I'm always ready to go, 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 go. Ain't no time to play dangerous than a motherfucker. Blood oats. If I die, everybody go. All my enemies. Nigga, blood oats. 
Anybody I have any words with, nigga, if I go, your ass definitely grass. This, this is what it is. Blood oats with my family. They Anybody they into it with, if they go, your ass go. That's understood. Taliban type shit, nigga. Pick up the rifle when your loved one fall, nigga. We ne could never be scared of no blackface Ku Klux Klan members, nigga. I don't want to be here if I'm fearful to talk on real stuff and be real, nigga. If I ever wake up fake, nigga, I'm going to strangle my goddamn self, nigga. Too real to think like that. Long live Pimp C. Justice for Pimp C. But it killed Pimp C, man. And it hurt me. Because the pimp died at the hands of haters. And then other people too fearful to speak. Salute his family. And, and people like Heezy and other and, and 17 and Young Hog, I had Heezy Leo at the interview. Me, I had the interview with 17 and Young Hog. I'm getting them brothers back on this platform. Me and Heezy Leo, I already been trying to work some stuff out to do some more interviews with one another. I'm going to be respectful as I can when I bring her back on to talk about Pimp because it's really touchy for them. I can move on to other things at times, but I know for them, it's always Pimp. So that's why I'm going to use my goddamn voice and say, Justice for Pimp. And we're not scared of no goddamn body, ever, in life. we scared to fail the community. Pimp CK should be reopened, and he should be getting justice. We don't get, oh, oh, okay, they need to come out and put it on record. This man executed Pimp C and then uh, bragged about it, and then had the nerve to call a nigga mama and talk about he owned UGK. I suggest y'all go back and watch that super tight, this interview. Y'all who ain't seen it, y'all who have seen it, okay, I seen it now. I'm reporting on it now. I know you've been waiting on it. Well, here it is. Now, what we going to do about it? Long live pimp. Cuffield. Follow me.